Hi, this is Anna from JustPaint.com. Today I'm going to do another Christmas demo. This is going to feature some cute little cheek art penguins that I'm going to make with a tag one stroke called Magpie. And it's, they're going to be jumping around in a little winter scene. The one stroke penguins are super cute, but actually I'm going to be using a dauber sponge instead of a brush. But before I get to the penguins, I'm going to take some of this Maron Precious Gem Powders. It's called Diamond, and it sparkles like diamonds <laughs> yeah. in the sky. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm just using a little Cornell Smoothie Blender, the Maxine Smoothie. And I'm going to gently sparkle my face. I love this for Christmas designs because you can sparkle really fast the whole kid's face almost and just then put the design on one corner of their cheek or something like that you don't have to paint their whole face but you can really cover their face with some magic even though the design is concentrated on one area all right um, I'm going to use tag winter dream for the water and I can't find, oh, this is the other Da Vinci brush, this one's the short handle one. They're the same, they just uh, look a little different with the handles. And I'm going to load up the Da Vinci brush here in the Winter Dream. You can only get the Winter Dream at JustPaint.com. It's our favorite Christmassy, sparkly rainbow cake. Winter. Wintery. It's very wintry. Let me be clear. And then I'm just going to pool some water around that the dolphins, I mean not dolphins, <laughs> that the penguins, what are those things? penguins mm -hmm. are going to be jumping in. Uh, I'm going to keep the light color ooh, around my eye so I don't look like I have a dark eye. And then I think I'm going to just take a sponge actually and blend some of the teal and the white together around there. And then I'll put a little extra here. And then a cliff. I need to build a cliff here for my penguin to jump off of. Okay, it looks like I've been beat up, but everything's going to work out fine. Now I'm going to take a smaller dauber sponge and I'm loading it up in the magpie and I just want the black on the very edge and that's going to be the back side of the dolphin <laughs> penguin <laughs> I'm so used to painting dolphins oh my god penguin whenever I think of something in the water I automatically think dolphin all right um, the, once I have that loaded up I'm going to squeeze it so that it's kind of uh, peanut shaped See that peanut? Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to stick it kind of at an angle on my forehead and pat it so it looks like he's jumping forward. Ooh, pat, 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 pat. Whoa, this guy's bold. Whoa. I have to see this more up close. I'm going to pat a little dot in the front for his head. Woo! So it's kind of like a big, long peanut. And then I'll put another one over here. I'm going to make him more standing up. And he's going to be the waddler. Let's see. And you can use that again to make the head. Since this one's kind of like a little more up in the up close, I'm going to use the circle and pounce it tight, pinch to make a little head. Now, all I gotta do is use a brush for some black details. I'm gonna use Wolf Black. And I need to pop some wings. And penguins kind of waddle around all funny with their wings stuck, sticking back from behind their body. So I'm just gonna put his little wings back there. And this one, I'm gonna have his wings shooting out. Woo! Woo! So he's having a good time, too. And then. For speed's sake and reality's sake, I'm going to give them black feet because penguins really don't have 
orange feet. Maybe there's some special breed, but most of them have black feet. And I think the orange feet's just like a cartoon thingamabob. <laughs> okay, That's so lit. this one's just like walking all crazy. And then this one's doing his jump, and then they need noses. And once again, for speed and reality, I'm going to give them little black noses. I'm just going to outline the back of the head, and this one will be talking. Ah, ha, ha. And then oh, I'm going to outline his little tummy. And his butt. And we'll give him some fur. This one, too. And then I'll just outline this one's little body. And now they just need some eyeballs. Um, this one up here, actually, I'm going to make it all black around the top of his head because they usually have a black streak going around their head and then they just have little white where their eyes are. And then I'm going to paint little white dots here for the eyes. I need to pull the mirror up close so I can see. This one will give a black eye. And he looks kind of like a chicken. Alright, that's okay. Some penguins look like chickens. Alright, there's so many kinds. And then I'm going to do, while that's drying, I'm going to do some white, wispy snow details. Where's the eye for the top one? His eye's coming. I'm waiting for the black to dry. Uh -oh. And then I'm going to draw a white eye patch. Because he's so small, we're just going to do a little white highlight where he has a little fuzzy white eye patch. Alright, I'm going to highlight this little guy's belly, and then I'm just going to do some snowy ice drift lines. And this guy is jumping off of a cliff. Whoa! And he's going to be jumping into the water. Whoa! And maybe some little do-do-do. Some magic little teardrops to pull it all together. And little highlights on their wings. So their wings pop out. And then this little guy, I'm just going to put a little erp, erp for where his little eye should be. He told me he wanted a nose job, but I'm not sure if I'm going to give him one. I think it's good like that. Okay. I think it's good like that. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. I don't want to screw him up. You're right. Okay. So anyhow, oh, and a little white highlight in this guy's eye and some glitter we have some glitter that people want I'm hearing all about it um great oh we have Y body stardust again this is such a great Christmas glitter it's like got silvers and golds and whites and I wore it the other day all day and it would not fall off my face until I washed it at night. I killed my penguin. Hold on one second. I just slaughtered his head when I did that last surgery. I told you. You know, I should. Oh my god, I killed it some more. It's turning into the elephant man penguin. Ah! Well, you got the idea. Yeah, you got the idea. Let me put some sparkles there. <laughs> Ta da! And there it is. It's a penguin fiesta. And I have to say, I face painted at a Christmas party and penguins were the number one choice. They beat out Santa Claus, reindeer, and snowmen. Those so, are evil penguins. Well, they didn't beat them up. They just were the biggest choice. Oh, so okay. give your penguins a shot. Let me show you on my arm here. Also, I was doing some penguin practice. This guy's missing his eyeballs, but I have little Chunky, the Chunky penguin. And I just used the daughter sponge to make his stomach and then put a black circle and then did the details on top and then this is a two daughter sponge this is glamorous the glamorous penguin she has a pearl necklace but they're actually icicles and then this is Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer wearing a penguin costume because and an orange he, nose yeah and an orange nose he but it's a daughter sponge a daughter sponge and then I dragged it 
the, for the legs and the neck, and then I used black to do the details. And there's that little jumping penguin, and there's the little walking one. So you play with your daughter sponges, and you can make all sorts of cute little critters. And you can use your arm as a cheat sheet. Yeah, you'd be like, what would you want? This fat one, this pretty one, this jumping one, or Rudolph dressed as a penguin? Tell me the truth, kids. All right, um, thanks for watching. Check out our website, justpaint.com, for really awesome products, and send us more requests. Have a great day.